Well, one for the money, two for the show. Are you getting ready now? Listen, i got to hit the hay. You can hear my voice getting hoarse. Let me go get my water. Hang on. Hang on. When I get my voice like this, I can really get the voice. Oh, here. My pook is trying to get me to overplay my hand and hang myself. That's why my pook is saying, you're an idiot. My pook is not going to give up on that. When I... My Puka said, yeah, you got it. That, if you believe that, don't. Don't believe Puka that agree with you. <laughs> no, no, no. I read Puka messing with me too long to buy that one. Know it. Huh. Wow. <laughs> I'll be right back. Never... Remember, I don't use the word trust. It's just to, to, don't even risk things with a puka. Don't even get in that position that you're in risk with this thing. Don't. Is puka showing up at your house too? Because it could. It's your puka as well as mine. And I affirm it. Not a ghost, it's your maker. The puka, not a ghost. He's talking about a, no, he ain't. He's talking about a puka. Not any of the things you're, there's no synonym to a puka than all these other words. Don't use them. That's a, a puka is a puka. Not anything, my brain doesn't even, big brother's button in now and just forget it. Forget it. Forget it. I hear all kinds of input coming all over the place. Forget it. Forget it. I know what I'm getting erupted. I know. I'm getting interrupted around here. I have all kinds of, they're not voices, they're conceptual input, and I overhear it. It's not a voice. I don't hear voices, what do you mean? No, I don't hear voices. I'll tell you why. When I hear the Supreme Court's remarks and stuff, now somebody's hearing some voices. Yeah, they are. Mm-hmm. Well, let them describe the source of their wit. Let's just put it that way. And my wit is not a voice I hear with my ears. And I don't hear it. No, no. But when the Lord talks to me, there is no voice at all, no tone. I don't hear anything. I When I converse with my maker or my puka, I use none of the aspects of conversing here at all. No, I don't. It's got nothing to do with conversing here or any way you do it here. So I can't use the words of conversing here to describe it, can I? Can I? When you talk to this puka, the Lord... Can you use the words of conversing here to talk about describing with that? When it's a script written before stars and planets in your DNA, you do it with your wits more than anything. You're a big troll on that conversation. It ain't happening in present tense. So you can't use the words of present tense conversation to talk about it, can you? Because it ain't. So what's that? Do you understand what I'm saying to you? What's he saying? <laughs> well, I'm not sure. You, I was hoping you'd understand. <laughs> I don't know what I just said. For Christ's sake, somebody's got it. <laughs> I'm speaking in tongues that you can interpret it, can't you? Without you, who's going to understand what's going on? <laughs> Come on, audience. Yeah, it's entertaining. Anyway, look. Non-profit get out of bikes. Dumb. Why are not profits regulating bikes? Dumb. The input is, I want you right now in everybody's mind, quickly. Nobody's got a car. No cars. Everybody's on a bike. What do you think that's like? And it's built utopia for bikes. I mean utopia. Do you got any cops around? Traffic cops? Do you have rules and enforcement and penalties? Cruelty? Is cruelty going to maintain the road then just like that now? Well, then you got a mess. In fact, if you and when your lifestyle stays the same as it is, and you all get on a bike, you won't like it. You drag that bike, that lifestyle you live every day, into the bicycle and start commuting with them. You're going to be real sorry. You don't have four wheels anymore. You got two. You gonna put grandma on a bike too? Are you? The mass transportation doesn't affect grandma's lifestyle at all. It doesn't respect her. It has nothing to do with her. Uh, they're idiots of her lifestyle themselves and don't even know what mass transportation is for. It's for air quality and you don't hear them. Have they produced an advocate on this globe for mass transportation? Have they? 
How many years they know they need mass transportation and there's no advocate to citizen? Why? No vision in the employee. That's why. Now, the citizen has to outvision all this maggot employment going on here right now, buckaroo. Wanna bet? Giddy going. This is a citizen's remark. Has nothing to do with government, employee, or anything else, and you gotta quit blaming them because they can't do it! There's only one guy can do it. Citizen! Move! Vision! Contribute! All hands, contribution station. Get! <laughs> well, I'm hoarding you, ain't I? I'm a mascot on a ship, I'm a monarch! The last one, and that is a mascot on a ship. Monarch. Vows to you. Monarch. Need you.